Hey drummers, welcome back to Rooney Reacts. I'm a drum teacher here in Auckland, New Zealand, reacting to some of the world's most interesting and most entertaining drum videos that I can find on YouTube. This one's all about Keith Moon. Who? That's right, The Who drummer. Again, The Who is a band I'm not overly familiar with. I know you're thinking, dude, you're a drum teacher. Who do you know about? Of course I know who The Who is and I know some selected tracks. I have heard this song before, I wouldn't be able to hum it to you or definitely not play the drums back to you on, I, I don't know it that well. So this will be like a first listen and I've never really paid a lot of attention to Keith Moon's drumming, although I know he's another sort of, um, he's another legend, he's another guy that sort of set the tone for rock drumming and was known as a bit of a rebel, but unique. Um, and I've gone back to, this is their first album, the album My Generation, and I did that because I wanted the full moon. Sorry about that, but seriously, I did want the full moonness. I, I This is early on, and I understood he ran into a few problems, in a, and there were a few comments sort of suggesting that later on in the who and uh, the life of... Keith Moon that the drumming suffered a bit and it didn't sort of capture that raw um, genius potentially. So without blabbering on too much more, let's check out the Who My Generation Isolated Drums. Bonham Keith Moon. Who was Crater? Crater? Moon? Let's carry on. So one thing I'm noticing straight away, especially with, you know, 2020 ears and 2020 aesthetics, it is a bit all over the place. And I don't mean that necessarily in a bad way. It's just, th there's a lot of ideas and there's a lot of different things coming through. One minute he's on the ride, then he's on the bell of the ride, then we're hitting a lot of crash and it's, and then there's fills and then it's, it's quite chaotic, but I'm sure it's quite brilliant because I get the feeling with Moon, he is the kind of drummer who is going to make a lot more sense with the track. Um, I regret watching this with the video, actually, because I, I should have just gone for the audio because the video is not a sync. And one other thing I'm really noticing with Moon is there's a lot of space in his drumming. Oh, are we about to destroy all our instruments? Tell you one thing, listening back to a bit of Moon, he always comes in with a big bang. So again, like I did with the Bonham Led Zeppelin track, I'm going to check out the Who My Generation, the actual full track next. There's a lot of stuff going on there and I'm really curious to see how it works with the vocals and the other instruments and um, try and get... Uh, further insight actually into what makes Keith Moon such a legend other than being fairly early on and you know rock and roll and and being a trendsetter and being someone who inspired a lot of other drummers. I would also be really interested to know how much sort of um, off the cuff random crazy genius this is or how much he plan it. Sorry about all the moon puns. Be sure to like, subscribe, and check out the next video, which will be me reacting to the actual song, My Generation by The Who. All right, take it easy.